Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration um, reading for the Gemini Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful support, likes, and shares. Please remember to listen to your Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. And thank you for returning. Please thumbs up, like, and share these videos. This is the week of an Earth Energy, and it's the last week of September. The week begins from the 24th until the 30th. I want to say to each and every person, thank you for your wonderful support, your kindness, and I love you, Gemini's. Okay, you Gemini's, um, the number um, um, for you guys this week um, energies is um, of the two of cups working together with others love coming in at work new start new beginning new office is about to come in for you Gemini's um, listen to your um, listen to your family and listen to your own intuition but listen to your family your families are going to be or someone of a mother figure or your intuition your guides is going to be aligned in you and um, love is going to be coming in for you guys okay um, it is a week of you working together on yourself or with someone else whether in business or, or whether at work now um, the week is a week of a hurt energy which is very wonderful because there's no supporting energies for you Gemini so it is going to be positive because um, the week is a week of balance that is coming in there's a lot of fire sign there's a lot of water but positive water some of you could be connecting in the weekend with someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, some of you men will be connecting with this person okay um so um as we look um at this energy as we look at this energy and we're trying to focus and see what is happening um we have the energy of the nine of wands so the energy of the nine of wands is coming in on monday for you gemini's and this is saying um no need to worry um whatever is going on around you um you are ready and alert and um or um and this and um tuesday is a water sign you're seeing the truth of a situation with your boss or with someone in an organization or in an organization or with your boss so you're spiritually protected from your boss whoever this person is or um your father you're spiritually protected from your father and you're seeing the truth of a situation so some of you is your father some of you is your boss some of you is someone in an organization or a powerful city someone who has more power over you you're spiritually protected from this situation okay you you are divinely protected and you're seeing the truth about the situation as we move forward um we are seeing the truth of someone um um because on wednesday you have the ten of cups on wednesday you have the ten of cups now this energy of the ten of cups is a wonderful energy because this is the energy of the ten of cups is um a happy family life okay a happy family life so some of you could be connecting um with uh, a fire sign you ladies are going to be connecting with someone who is a um, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and you men are going to be connecting with someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion in the weekend listen to your intuition whoever you're connecting with um, this um, princess of cups is very early intuition listen to your intuition she might be younger than you are but still listen to what she has to say because there is some um, information that she needs to tell you the weekend is going to be positive some of you um, could have a situation on um, with work or with a father figure maybe your father is an Aries um, or and your brother some of you could be having a situation with your father and your brothers and sister in the weekend so um, expect this that a situation is going to be coming up but it's going to be a positive situation it's going to be aligning you in a positive way so 
as we look at Tuesday, Tuesday is a, a situation where some of you are going to be seeing the truth of a situation, whatever the truth is about a situation that has to do with the Knight of Wands. Whoever this Knight of Wands is, this is um, this Knight of Wands is um, uh, whoever this Knight of Wands is, you're going to see the truth of a situation and see um the ten of cups so some of you could be connecting now as i said about a work situation or something that you're protecting yourself from or you're being protected from um you're seeing the truth of the situation and it has to do with a work situation it has to do with something to do with work um if you were deciding um to work with someone and you weren't feeling something going on um whatever your intuition was telling you listen to your intuition um, it's as if someone was trying to get you in a business situation to get you tied up in a business situation um, but you were spiritually protected because it's as if you wake up you woke up and you thought <clears throat> no <clears throat> I'm not seeing the truth about this I need to see uh, a whole his cards in his hand or her all what she has um, in her hands and um, you, you you decided now there's something that is not um, completely right um, there is something that is not above water with the situation there's something that has been kept that I'm not I, I, I'm not aware of so I decided not to go further so that's that is good what you have done okay there is going to be some conflicts this could happen on um tuesday wednesday tuesday for some people wednesday for some people or saturday now whatever this conflicts is is that um some of you who are aligned with uh, a um a man that is an aries leo or sagittarius some of you see the truth about this man okay so if you are with a guy between the ages of 25 and 40 that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarian you're seeing the truth about this person and um, you know they're completely happy with their family you know you're they're completely happy with their family it could be that you're connected with this person and you realize that this is the person I should be aligned with because there is where my happiness lies um, that is a person that I want to build a family with and that that is where my happiness lies and that is what is going to be happening for some of you so if some of you if you have been seeing an Aries Leo or Sagittarius for quite some time and now there was you know a, a, some quarrels some um, miscommunication and now um, you're going to be realizing oh my god that is the person that is the man of my dream that is the person that I want to be with okay so let's move on um, there is going to be some conflicts in the family but listen to your own intuition over this situation so there is going to be really challenging situation that has to do with family some of you are going to be seeing the truth of a family situation that has to do with um, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius um, um, 25 years and older okay between the age of 25 and 40 you're going to see the truth it's as if there's going to be some conflicts that is coming out and that sort of a thing but you're going to be seeing um, the truth of this situation you're just going to be um, seeing the truth of this situation alrighty as we move forward we're going to be looking to see what is happening with your boss um, some of you are dealing with someone um, dot is because he's coming up twice so um, a lot of you Gemini's um, could be dealing with this person at work here he is at work but here he is it could be a brother figure uh, in, in the family um, so this um, man came up twice that is uh, between the ages of 25 and 40 some of you he's affecting you at work some of you he is affecting you in a relationship sense or in the family it is more of a family situation for some of you he is here as in a family situation whatever that is transpiring at work you want to move forward and this man can either end you or help you um, he is working with um, some of you okay so what I'm seeing here is that 
whoever um, this person is. Um, I'm seeing him work with someone who is a, um, I'm seeing him work with someone who is a Pisces, Cancer or a Scorpion. This could be a family member. Okay. Or this could be someone who is connected with his family that he's working with because here you men over the age of 40, you, this could be your kids, men over the age of 40. If you have um, a son that is an Aries, Leo or Sagittarian, these people are between the ages of 15 and 25, your kids, there is a family situation that is going on and there's conflict between these two kids. So if you're a man 40 years and older, um, you are, have to resolve a family situation between your son and daughter um, because there is a huge conflict, family feud that is going on here. You can see this. See, it's all about conflicts and um, really conflicting things that is going on um, with these two kids and you need to resolve it. So if you are a man um, and you have kids that is... Um, um, between the ages of 15 and 40, um, that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarian or a, a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion, you need to resolve this family feud between these two kids. Okay, some of you, um, if your daughter is with this guy, you need to resolve the situation. It's not really a healthy relationship because there's a lot of conflicting things with the family. It's as if your fairy godmothers, for the people who are dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion girl between the ages of 15 and 40, she's very intuition. She feels things, she knows things, and she sees things, okay? So be aware of this thing because she is very, very highly intuition, okay? Our intuition is on park. For some of you, um, at work, someone who is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius between the ages of 25 and 45, you could be having a conflict in things with this person, but not to worry because um, it's going to be okay. All right, not to worry. Um, there is going to be forward movement going forward for you, and um, it's going to be in a positive way. Some of you are really aligned in and seeing the energies of what is going on. You both have two major arcana, and these two major arcana is very important. It's listen to your intuition, especially on Thursday. Listen to your intuition. On Friday, some of you are going to be receiving message, or there could be an... Let's see um, what is going to be coming out because there's so much happening. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Oh, yeah. There is some jealousy. There is some jealousy um, that is happening at your work with this uh, um, man. There is a man that is an Aries and Leo or a Sagittarius. There is some jealousy that is going on at your work with this person and it is going to be coming out because Tuesday or sometime in the week, you're going to be um, really, um, really seeing this and aligning the, this. There is going to be a solution. A solution is going to be coming up for this situation with this uh, um, Prince of Wands. This is an Aries Leo Sagittarius. Um, for the people who are dealing with him as a brother, a father, or a sister, um, whoever this person is, there is going to be a solution, especially when it comes to the family. You're going to be seeing the truth of this person, who he is, what he has done. And there is going to be a solution coming up. Okay, out comes some surprise happiness, um, especially um, if you're in a relationship. If you're going to start a relationship with a, a, a woman, um, uh, whether she is, uh, um, if you're going to start a relationship with a lady that is um, um, a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, it's going to be a very good relationship. It could be someone in the family. Um, this lady is very um, highly um, psychic, okay? So some of you could be connecting. Um, it could be that this lady is, this young girl is going to be coming in some of you older ladies' life. 
and she's very psychic but very wonderful a very a positive nice person okay a very positive nice person and she is going to be helping you out okay so that that is very nice a lot of people are getting the key um, in this week um, the key is um, the uh, the solution of problems and the key important um, um, is important information um, um, it can be success for some people or it can be significant changes of success that is going to be coming in, in your life but the key is always something and some of you could be getting help to unlock a situation okay um, in career something significant is about to happen and you might need to take some action to receive the success you seek okay but do so and you should do it well so this is good especially in work the key when the key comes up in work is going to be um, very wonderful be happy good times are about to start for you okay so it is um, especially if you're connecting with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion be happy because good times is about to start for you it could be for some of you men um, if your daughter is a Pisces um, cancer or a scorpion something good is going to be happening for her you and her could be taking a trip and could be um, doing some stuff together okay let's see um, message in a bottle so this week is going to be positive some of you are, could be receiving messages from um, love messages messages from someone you haven't spoken to in a while um, messages is coming in from someone who deeply wants to connect with you but these are positive message whenever the message come in a bottle it could be um, for the men your kids um, want to connect with you um, there is going to be some wonderful positive news from the family or in the family which is good um, for work um, don't worry about it because there is someone um, that wants to block you but there is going to be a solution that is going to be coming up some good news um, is about to come message in a bottle some real good news is about to come so I want to wish you guys a wonderful week please remember um, to like share this video thumbs up and I speak to you next week